We turn now to that very close call for two U.S. Navy warships, the near collision and the obvious question, how did this happen? This collision nearly played out in San Diego Bay, one ship appearing to head directly toward the other. In fact, they were just 35 yards apart at one point. Here's Martha Raddatz tonight. It is one of the narrowest points in San Diego Bay and one of the narrowest near misses in recent memory. This video showing the massive ships on a clear collision course. The larger amphibious ship, Harper's Ferry, exiting the port with the smaller guided missile destroyer, Momsen, entering the port, facing head on into the larger ship. The Navy vessels coming within just 35 yards of one another. Warship 49, we are coming to port to avoid you. Warship 92, we are coming to port to avoid you as well. That means both ships had to veer left to avoid a collision. According to inland navigation rules, vessels approaching one another would normally be required to stay to the right and pass one another on the left. Maneuvering ships this large is actually hard when they're slow because it takes a long time for any rudder input to take effect. And so you can see this collision nearly happening. It's really a remarkable image, Martha, and to hear them on the radio saying we're looking to avoid you, both saying that back and forth to each other. Thankfully, no one injured, obviously, uh, and no damage to the ships, but I gather there's going to be a full investigation here. Exactly, David. The Navy says the sailors responded well to the impending collision, but this could have been a disaster. Aside from possible injury or damage to the ships, it could have shut down one of the busiest ports in the country right before Christmas. David. All right, Martha Raddatz with late reporting from Washington as well. Thank you, Martha. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.